Learn with Eddie. Hi, Eddie. You're back from bathing. Was the water nice? Great. Well, what can we do now? Maybe it's lunchtime already. What time is it, Eddie? What's the matter, Eddie? What's your watch? Oh, you dropped it. It must have been when you were swimming. Well, don't worry. We can go snorkeling and look for it. I'm sure we'll find it. Do you guys like snorkeling like Eddie? Please tell us in the comments. Wait, Eddie! Aren't you forgetting something? What do you need for snorkeling? That's right, Eddie! You'll need fins to swim faster. And what do you need for seeing under the water? But Eddie, you'll see everything dark with those sunglasses on. That's it! A snorkeling mask is much better! Done! You're good to go, Eddie! Can you see your watch anywhere, Eddie? Check it out, Eddie! Do you know what kind of fish that is? It's a shark! Some of them are dangerous, but this one is a baby and seems friendly. See? They have a long pin on their back, gills on the sides, and long, sharp teeth. Hey, maybe it's in your watch. I think we're supposed to follow it, Teddy. Check it out, Teddy. That octopus has your watch. Octopuses have a very big head and eight long, strong legs. Oh no! And how are we going to get back your watch now? Hmm. Hmm. Be careful, Eddie! Um, I'm sorry, Eddie. I forgot to tell you one more fact about octopuses. When they get nervous or scared, they squirt black ink. <laughs> but hey, you got your watch back, right? <laughs> Come on, let's go back to the beach so that we can take a shower. Hi, Eddie! I see you're getting ready for your scuba diving lesson. Mm -hmm. Do you have your camera ready? Well then, come on, Eddie, let's do this! Today, we will get to see some sea animals, and you will take pictures of them, okay? Check it out! This is the first animal we've seen. Do you know what it's called? It's a dolphin! And it's one of the most intelligent, loving animals in the world. <laughs> and dolphins can communicate with each other from long distances by making a really funny noise. Say goodbye to the dolphin, Eddie. <laughs> All right, Eddie. Let's see what other animals we can find. Check it out, Eddie. It's a little fish. Do you know what it's called? It's a clownfish! <laughs> this kind of fish is very colorful and funny. That's why they are called clownfish. Come on, say goodbye, Eddie. <laughs> Let's see what other animals we can find. Check it out, Eddie. It's a sea turtle. Turtles move really slowly. And that's why they lived so many years. Besides, turtles live inside the shell which serves as a home and also protects them from other animals. <laughs> Let's see what other animals we find if we dive deeper. Wow, Eddie, those are so pretty. They are seahorses. These sea animals are called seahorses because they resemble the horses on the surface. Wow, you've got quite a photo collection there, Eddie. Did you like this experience? Great, Eddie. Now you're a diver! Here we are! Oh, the sun is really intense! But we came ready! What do you feel like doing today? Playing in the sand! That's so much fun! Do you want to build sand castles? And what about you guys? What do you like doing on the beach? You can tell us in the comments! Where do we begin? That's it! Good idea, Eddie! Did you know that castles had towers so the soldiers could see someone approaching from far? That's why they are so high! Okay, but not just anyone can come into our castle. We need walls! How do we build them? Of course! 
We can use our spade to build tall, straight walls. <laughs> Great, here is our castle. <laughs> but hang on a second, uh -huh. it's a built doll, isn't it? We could draw some pictures on it with our rig. Uh -huh. mm, let's see. Yeah, much better. Do you agree, Eddie? <laughs> can you think of anything else we can add? <laughs> Good idea, Eddie. We can use the seashells we picked up earlier as doors and windows. <laughs> Check out how cool it's turned out. It looks like a medieval castle. Eddie, where are you? <laughs> Eddie, 